Hello guys, welcome back to Pokemon Fire Red Omega with your host Flash. This part we will start doing something I do not like. Remember when we caught Voltorb blast part? We can't keep it. Why not? Well, we caught Voltorb in a round. We already caught a Pokemon in. You may be thinking, what? Are those two different routes? No. This is where I caught Swablu, and this is where I caught Voltorb. I thought it were two different routes, but apparently not, so I am not allowed to keep Voltorb. I shouldn't have caught it in the first place. It's a shame, but... Oh well. Sorry, my balls. If I capture a Voltorb, I will catch you. If I, uh, I will call you my balls again. So... I think I put oh wow he's not even healed god damn it well that was stupid honestly uh, okay now let's go to route 8 if you capture a Voltorb here that would be pretty cool honestly Julia oh Ju no that's Julia not Romeo and Julia not Romeo and Julia oh great the Jigglypuff, let's start with the round puffball. So, two day, no, not two days, yes, two days ago, yeah, what am I thinking? I went to a convention in Belgium here called Made in Asia. Um, as you can guess by the name, it's mostly Asian stuff with Asian workshops and seriously, Jigglypuff and stands where you can buy Asian stuff. Well, not all Asian stuff, but a lot of merchandise from ma anime, manga, gaming, some movies, uh, all that stuff. Um, and of course, I also bought a few things, and I went there, and it was freaking awesome. Um, I went there with a very, very good friend of mine, if I may say so. And why am I actually? Um, I I'm just rambling. No, not rambling, but I don't. <laughs> I'm talking too much and I don't know what I'm doing in the game. <laughs> so, uh, one of the things I, I, I bought the game for the Nintendo 64 called... Um, wait, wait, it's standing right next to me. The new Tetris for Nintendo 64. Because, why not? It... Ah! Yep. Uh, I'm not even going to comment on that anymore. Because, um, yeah. I never really have a Tetris game and it's always fun to expand my collection. I bought a, a little figurine of Mega Mawile, uh, Pokemon, very detailed, very nice quality, a figurine of Kesha Washa, or Washa, from the new Monster Hunter game, and a poster of Ariel from The Little Mermaid, not an official poster of Disney, but a fan made one from someone on DeviantArt. And it looks amazing. It's not on my wall yet because I have no idea where to place it. But I just need to have it because it's Ariel. Because it's the Little Mermaid. And that's the only things that I bought for myself. Yeah, that's very rare for me. Not buying. Almost not buying anything for myself. Because uh, if I go to a convention, I waste all my money. Almost always. And now I wasted what? Not even 50 bucks on everything. Well, for myself. For myself. There's also a few things that I bought for other people, because... Because uh, why not? Because I, I feel like that. I just like to... If I think someone likes it, I, uh, I like to buy it. Um, some people call it the positive thing about me. Some people call it the negative thing about me. That I'm so free in giving stuff to others, so... What did I buy for stuff for my friend that was with me that day? I bought a a dead note, literally the that the same book there, which you could write the name and people, you know. Um, I bought it for her, and I bought two things for another, in my opinion, if I may say so, a very good friend of mine. I never even met her in my life before, but she's a good friend of mine. People who say you can't get friends with someone you haven't met yet, fuck that. I bought her uh, a little figurine of Charmed at the same place I bought my Mega Mama. Because I was like, yeah, this looks so nice, I just wanted to have it. And I bought her a plushie of a Pokemon I will not mention yet. Oh, hello. Hello there, super nerd. Because 
I haven't told her what the plushie is. Well, I think she can guess it what it is. Because <laughs> I like... Um, mm, I asked her like a question like uh, subtle. Well, not really that subtle. But yeah, I, uh, she probably guessed what it is. <laughs> But yeah, I promised her I would buy that plushie, and I found one. I had to search quite a bit for it, but the first place I found the plushie, I bought it. Uh, because I was afraid I wouldn't find it anywhere else. And I was right. No other stand had a plushie of... Ta -ta 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 -ta. <laughs> and I hope she's gonna be very happy with it. And I also not say that because there's a, there's a good chance that she'll be watching this, so... <laughs> I'm not saying it. <laughs> For that reason. <laughs> so I hope you will like it. And really, really drowsy. Really, th this is what happens when you. When I don't really. Well, that has nothing to do with not paying attention, but. Slack on again? What the hell with the slack odds here, man? And poison gas! 55% chance to hit me, and it does, of course. But yeah, I love the convention. There were also a few workshops. Well, I didn't really do a workshop because, n not that it, it's nothing for me, but hey, I, I just let uh, her, my friend, participate. Like, uh, there was just like a bouncy, jumpy thingy. Uh, I don't really know how to describe. Looked dark fun. Um, and she also, my friend, did uh, participate in a um, workshop with. Oh, wait a minute. I will talk further in a minute. And a workshop of Korean paints. I don't. Or, yeah, of Korean. A Korean workshop with a um, sort of Korean paint. I don't know exactly what it is, but it's something. <laughs> Something, something. Double balance, I'm a bit afraid of those because what if both opponents target one of my Pokemon? Like, what if both of them target Nidhogg? Well, th those, these two are not trending in any way, but in the future, if there's much more dangerous Pokemon, and wow. Oh, you got to be freaking kidding me, right? Of course it happens. Uh, let's just dragon range you. Oh wow, still stupid. And what did I do also? Any convention? Yeah, um, not much. I just hang around, met 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 a few people, took a few pictures. Some people also took a few pictures of me. Um, met new people also, of course. And that's about one one negative thing about the convention though was it was so busy. I don't know the right word for it, but I'm just gonna say it's so busy because there were so so many people there. It wasn't even funny anymore. Someone it was so crowded, crowded, not busy, crowded. Or you can look far. So crowded. It was too crowded. And. They should have done a few things about it, and they didn't, but maybe next year. It's th I still advise everyone to go to it. I'm not gonna say it sucks. Don't go to it. Nah. No. And I hope to go to as many conventions as possible this year still. Because I love them. Slash that can actually hurt me a lot. Uh, I'm not risking anything, like I said before. And what is the next convention I'm going to? I don't know. Apparently there is Antwerp convention next month, which I didn't even know. But I don't know if I'm going because I just don't know if I'm going. <laughs> and but there's also a very well, it's not the I, I won't really call it a convention, but a little little retro gaming thingy, like one person. One guy is organizing it, and there'll be a few stands there where you can buy retro games. And uh, he will be organizing his own little NES or the NES tournament. For, for fuck's sake, come on! 
come on, Volt. Hit it. If this was smoke on, this was not allowed. Thank you, finally. And I'm, and I'm going to be participating on the next tournament. Because I want to. I was going to say that one word again, or two words, but I didn't. Because <laughs> um, last year also, I also went there and I participated. And I became, of the 16 participants, I became third place. Which was very interesting and very, <laughs> I didn't expect it to happen. Because I never ever played on the NES before. <laughs> yeah, it was very fun and I became third place. Um, and I won a, a pretty big giant, well big giant, a, bi a pretty big Yoshi plushie. And I love it. It's so awesome. Why are you faster now? You have the same speed. And it's pink. <laughs> Yoshi plushie is pink. I was so happy of it. I could not be more happier. And how did the, uh, how was the, tur the tournament itself? Well, first, like I said, we were with 16. Oh, that can be handy instead of a uh, layer. Uh, first, we were 16. And of the first place, Super Mario Bros. And you had to get as much points as you can in, oh, God, no. In five minutes of Super Mario Bros. Um, and I got of the 60 participants, I got the second highest score. Like I never played on the NES before, but uh, like everyone, I played Super Mario Bros. before. Like on my game, my car, Super Mario Bros. Deluxe. So I knew what to do. But I was so surprised I was second place. With I don't know how many points really. Don't don't ask me that. But the guy in first place, that was insane. He knows his games definitely. Um, gonna hear first. Yeah, the guy in first place, I don't know how much points he got, but it was like double of mine, and I was second place. He knew what to do in Super Mario Bros. for sure. Um, and the uh, best eight went on to the next uh, game, and that was Kung Fu. And in Kung Fu also, you need to get as much points as you can in... No, in one... Uh, seriously, Nidhogg, at one life. Oh, come on. So I need to do it one life, and I got to the second stage. Only the second stage. But I got enough points to get second place again. And again, the guy who got first place was the same guy. And again, he had an insane score. <laughs> and the best four of that. Come on, Skitty! This is what. This is karma. Now, this is karma. And uh, the best four of the eight went out to the next round. And that's where I lost then. I, of all the four people, I got third place. So what is the... Oh, fuck that, okay. Um, What did we have to do there? We had to play Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the arcade game. I think it was. Not 100% sure. And, um... What you need to do was, um, it was two player, uh, so two times two players, I'm gonna heal here, and the, the people of the two that um, survived the longest would, get, uh, would go to the next round. And I was paired with the guy who had the huge scores on the last... Uh, on the last two games, and I was like, I'm fucked. I am so fucked. There's no way I will survive this. But, I actually had a chance. Uh, it was an arcade game, just um, uh, a 2D sc 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 scroll, but beat him up and um, punching all the, uh, the clan, the foot clan, I think it was. And just. Yes, you had three lives, and the one, the first person who got lost all three lives lost. And we're actually very, very, he was better at the game than me. You could see that. But that was a bit lucky, Kurt, because there was like one healing item in like the in the first two stages. There's only one healing item in total, like only one. 
and I was able to grab that. And I was like, to the guy who was so good, I'm like, I'm so sorry that I picked that. Because it's so cheap, honestly. And I was actually saying, I'm sorry, man. But I need this or else I cannot win against you. <laughs> he didn't make any problem of it, though. Luckily. <laughs> well, luckily. And Oh, come on. And, uh... <laughs> And that, that was the fun, like the light, your uh, HP was shown in like little blocks. And we both had two lives lost and we both had like one block left. One block. It was so close. So whoever of us got hit once was going to lose. And we both were like, it was the second boss of fight and... and we both had like one life full HP when we started the boss, but <laughs> we both were like, we're not gonna run away from the boss. We're gonna just gonna do this like for real. Not gonna be a cheap way. We're both gonna try to defeat the boss, and we did it. And we both were sucking actually, guys, boss. Because before we start the game, I was like, you're so good at the previous two games. How good are you? Game? And we were like, I'm only a little bit decent. I only practiced a little bit. We didn't know what games we were going to play, but he said I practiced a lot of the NES games just because I also play a lot of NES games. I both had like one one block left of HP, so it was so close, but I was unlucky to get hit by that one attack of the boss. <laughs> but why did I become third place and not like fourth place? Because there's two two. Well, um. Um, they decided who got third and fourth place by the amount of um, enemies you defeated killed. And I killed more enemies than the guy who got fourth, to say this. I killed like 20 enemies or 10 enemies more. And that's why I got third place and not fourth place. And I was actually very happy with that. And the final game that they had to play was... Um, uh, oh, I don't know what game it is. I think it was Dragon's Lair, Dungeon's Lair, or something like that. One thing I know is that it's the game is so cheap. It's a bad game, just it's so cheap. <laughs> and that's why it was the final game to see who who could be beat or who could get as far as they can in that one cheap game. And the guy who was who beat me, who beat everyone in all the rounds, won. It was only no what? No 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 I really thought this was going to be the first death. Holy shit. Why does this right you have, sir? Oh, fuck. Whew. So that was my tournament. Uh. Yes! Finally! <laughs> the dog is evolving. Man, I'm actually rambling a lot in, in this bar. Rambling about stuff. God, our dragon there. This is gonna be a pseudo legendary. Well, let's hope so. Ah, uh, look at all those stats are so decent. Uh, such a shame he's bolt nature. That's such a shame. It lowers the attack but ups the defense. So that's such a shame. But I have a dragon there. His attack is still gonna be freaking amazing. Man, Tartrio. Woo hoo! Remember not to put you against the uh, right you again. I really thought it was good to die because well, maybe it, my service may not be Raichu's type, but Raichu has decent special attack, and the Duck Trio has not that good special defense and such low HP. So I really was 100% sure he was good to die. So I'm very glad he didn't. Because Yens, I don't want Yens to die. Not this soon. What Pokemon am I gonna use then? Now we're finally using other Pokemon, Dan. Um, and Dragon, actually Dragonair. I need to say now, the Nidhogg. Oh yeah, it's just just magnitude. 
Now this will one hit KO. Not, not the right shoe didn't, but the Slugma, it will. It must. You for real, kid. I'm the real nigga here. I'm the real G. <laughs> so weird saying that. <laughs> like like that that one song like I really do not like rap. There may there are maybe a few songs that are not that bad. But there are like so many songs in rap and I hear the lyrics and I'm like how can people like this? How can people like now that's some good music man like there's this song that's really called My Nigga and the only thing that they almost say in the whole song is my nigga my nigga my motherfucker and that's the only thing they say and I'm like how can someone like that really how can you like a song Ooh, box of eye. I'm so it's like blasphemy how how I really do not understand but that's the way it goes apparently in the music business I don't understand the music business I will never understand it but that's the way it is I definitely hate rap but it's always about nigga, ho, slut and all that stuff it's like that's the only thing they can or they talk about their shoe game like well, oh he's real he's real man he's so real that that's a, that's a real man he knows what life is about about shoes about shoe game okay this oh my two two more trainers damn this is gonna be a, a long part I think this guy has no in the original game he has polywax and polywool so we'll see a bit still in this game. I'm so so surprised I have not. Oh, yeah, great. That's that. That's one great thing I did here. That's so great. Yeah. I'm still surprised that nobody on my team has died yet. And I'm confident the Phoenix defeating the Volta. Well, even if it uses Spark, it will, he will not die. She will not die. Phoenix will survive. Because it's just the Volta. Oh, it's the other guy that has the Poly Worlds. Oh, I'm so stupid. Ah. Uh. This was the bit I see. I see now a lot of the normal trains now have evolutions also, so the game is gonna get a bit harder now. Ten. <laughs> really funny ten. There's only a five percent chance of ten happening. That's powerful. But they should kill. Yep. And Jens will continue being the the highest level party member. Coughing. Uh huh. Flare. Get your ass dog. Your ass dog here. Your dog ass <laughs> in here. Again? One hit KO the cop and one bite. How does he do that? And a magnemite. Let's keep it. Die. Ah, uh, just not. Meltdown. Eh, 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 eh. <laughs> Alright, let's play. I wanna play a game. The Saw movies. Started out great. Ended pretty poorly. Oh, I was right about the police. Really, the Saw movie. Like the first Saw movie, I think was great, really. Nice premise. Second movie, not as good, but nice premise. And they made seven. Seven Saw movies. Seven. Milk the cow till it's dry. Nah, those movies are definition of milking. And the movies get worse and worse and worse. And uh, oh no 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 no. Hooey! I got scared way too easily apparently. But uh um. Yeah, the Saw movies uh, started out so good, and then I didn't use Ice Punch. I didn't. I don't understand. Um, 
but I don't even know why I continued watching all the movies. I saw all seven, even the last one, which is pretty horrible. The first two were still good, but then it got so horrible. I was like, can it finally stop, please? Now it finally stopped, though. I'm sure gonna announce a new movie someday or a reboot. I will scream a little bit. Like, La! please, thank you. Okay. I like it when they call it gamer instead of ramblers, gamblers, like in the original game. And there's, I don't think there's any item here or something. Uh, if there was, I'm stupid. So we can't go there yet, like I said before, or maybe I haven't even said it before. Oh yeah, we will go there next part. And another ground pad. Uh, well, you're not used. I will not use, I will not use the bicycle, I will not use, will not use, I will not use the bicycle. Yep, there are two, and this is round seven, so ooh, two Pokemons to catch, honestly. But I'll keep that for next part, because this one is long enough as it is already. Okay, so we arrived in Saladan City. Okay, okay, dude, no problem. No, actually, that is a problem. No problem. It is good. So let's heal first. And, yep. I will end the episode here, because that is enough. For, that is enough for sure. So, peepsies. I will see you guys next time when we will catch a few Pokemon. I think three. And we will explore Sala City because this is a big city. This is such a big city. So, I hope you see you guys next time. Have a dashing good day. And see ya.